The king is reportedly preparing to take decisive action against his brother, Prince Andrew, who has defiantly refused to vacate the lavish royal lodge. This escalating family feud has captured public attention, as the king seeks to enforce a more streamlined monarchy, while Andrew clings to his opulent lifestyle. Prince Andrew, the disgraced Duke of York, has lived in the Royal Lodge since 2004, a sprawling estate valued at approximately 30 million pounds. However, following a series of scandals, including his association with convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein, Andrew's royal privileges have been significantly curtailed. King Charles has cut off Andrew's annual allowance, which previously helped cover the costs of his security and living expenses, leaving the Duke in a precarious financial position. Despite the financial squeeze, Andrew remains resolute in his decision to stay at the Royal Lodge. Sources close to the Duke claim he insists he can afford the upkeep and security of the property, even as reports suggest the estate is falling into disrepair. Royal commentator Rupert Bell has noted that Andrew's arrogance and sense of entitlement are major factors in his refusal to budge, as he feels losing his home would mean losing everything else he has left. As tensions mount, King Charles is said to be considering a nuclear option to evict his brother. This could involve serving Andrew with an eviction notice under the Housing Act, which would allow the king to reclaim the property if Andrew is deemed to have violated the terms of his tenancy. Such a move would not only assert Charles's authority, but also signal a new era for the monarchy, one that prioritizes accountability and responsibility. The implications of this family feud extend beyond just the two brothers. King Charles's actions could reshape the royal landscape, particularly as he aims to modernize the monarchy and distance it from past controversies. Andrew's insistence on remaining at the royal lodge, coupled with his desire for the property to be inherited by his daughters, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie, complicates matters further. As the situation unfolds, all eyes will be on King Charles to see how he navigates this familial crisis and what it means for the future of the British royal family. And that's it for our video. I will like to see what you think in the comments. Thanks and see you in the next video.